business as usual for the Minutemen in their home opener to begin the season. Led by a host of weapons, number five UMass able to hold off Albany 28-16 in front of a jam-packed crowd. The beautiful new lights shining down in the home opener of this one. Albany actually was up 9-0 in this game. Second quarter, QB Liam Cohen rolls out of the pocket, finding Ian, Ian Jorgensen in the end zone for the two-yard strike. Minutemen down 2-9-7. Cohen, the career passing leader, not done yet, finds Tony Nelson for the two-yard strike. UMass going into the half with a 14-9 advantage. Cohen 10-20 for 20 for 92 yards. Third quarter, Nelson gets the handoff and wait a second. There he goes. See you later. Nelson goes 64 yards for the touchdown score. He finished with a career high 171 yards of rushing with two touchdowns. UMass wins its seventh straight season opener. The Minutemen will next face Holy Cross. Now, if you love everything about UMass football, then join us here on CBS3 Springfield for UMass Football Weekly with head coach Don Brown giving you an in-depth look to the UMass football team throughout the 2008 season. The UMass soccer team avenges a 1-0 loss to Holy Cross with a 3-2 win in double overtime over Boston University. And the women's field hockey team earns their first win of the year, shutting out Quinnipiac 3-0. The hey, sports fans, I'm Ryan Walsh. The UMass football team is opening its season with high expectations. That comes with being ranked fifth in the nation, as well as plenty of question marks this year. A whole new receiving core, a new running back, and a revamped offensive line making their first starts against Albany. UMass playing under the new lights at McGurk Stadium. And if you build it, they will come 15,000 strong. Second biggest opening day crowd for UMass. Third quarter, UMass down 9-0. Make that second quarter. Liam Cohen hits Ian Jorgensen, and the Minutemen are on the board. Then Cohen fakes me out. Play fake to Tony Nelson. He gets into the house. UMass led 14-9 at the half. We move to the third quarter now, and Nelson just follows his fullback and that revamp line. Spinderella hit me up one time, and he's off to the races. 64 yards into the house, and UMass goes up 21-9. Albany gets within five in the fourth quarter, but UMass answers. Cohen the Jeremy Horn for the touchdown connection. The Minutemen open with a 28-16 win and may have found their newest star in the backfield. I don't know if you expect that, um, but we knew he, I have a lot of confidence in Tony's ability. He's prepared well this summer. Um, and he certainly looked like, a, you know, a very, very solid CAA running back, a guy that we can count on to carry the load, and he, and he certainly has my trust. Well, first, first care is a little bit nervous, a little bit, then I kind of got into the game more and started, you know, trusting my old lineman and seeing the holes and seeing the reads, and uh, it felt good to break that long run, like a reliever. The fifth-ranked Minutemen hit the road next week when they visit Holy Cross.